what up, what up, man? Y'all see, it's still me, off Terry Road, and out here, man. I mean, still in Cleveland, but I'm out here on the east side of Cleveland. A lot of people in the real estate game don't want to mess with the east side of Cleveland, but I believe in like the diamond in the rough. Like even when you driving around, driving for dollars, and you coming out to these different states, if you from the ghetto in the inner city, that's where the that's where the gems is. You learn that. And in life, that's where the gems is at. Like I said, the diamonds in the rough. So I found the diamond in the rough right here. I want to show y'all something. Y'all see where I'm at? I'm in this big lot, first of all. I'm in this lot. Next to the lot, next to the lot, you got this 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 duplex right here, right? Now, on the duplex, as you see, as you get a good view of the duplex, the roof. You see the roof? Probably be some roof work. You see the drainage hanging down from the from the. From the from the, from the roof from the roof the drainage but if you look at this duplex real good look at the foundation the foundation in this duplex is still good you see they got the cement slabs right there the brick slabs look towards the under there towards the basement you look towards the basement you see the basement slabs is good the foundation is good on this property make a long story short look at the windows you could tell they put like new new windows in there probably a few years back but the windows is still new so this duplex got a lot of potential in it when you really look around and look at it and like i say this is a field that i'm in right here so if you look you see this field right here this field is adjacent to this property so what i do if i was to get this property I will try to hit the city up and claim ownership of this of this field right here, probably for a couple hundred dollars. You never know. With that being said, I'm out here, still out here, just just to show y'all what we out here doing and um and getting toward in Cleveland. Like I say, this is a property. I might get it for under ten thousand. I'm gonna be honest with you. I might get it for under ten thousand. It probably need about ten thousand to work into it. But would I would I be at the, the ARV on it? Probably is only probably at about 15. So to some people that's that's not good because you have no equity in the house. So the whole thing about it, I want to try to get it at about five and put about 10 into it. That means the ARV is there is that I won't lose. But what I'm doing right now is a buy and hold. If you look in this community, this community is still. It got a lot of vacants and stuff like that, but this community is still what they call it's residential people over here. It's a lot of people that's renting. So what I do with this property, I'll buy and hold. That's what that's called, buy and hold. I will buy and hold this property right here on the strength that, okay, I'm not looking for a flip. I'm not looking for a, re a good return on this. So the ARV, what I'll do is, if I was to go refi, I'll go refi on the income that's coming to this, this duplex. You kind of get what I'm saying after I repair it. But as you see, it's people in this duplex already. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to negotiate and see what I could get this duplex for. So, you know, on the next episode.